This is one of my favorites. What we're going to do is um, we're going to play. And for this, it does not matter how you bend it. But I have seen people with this one end up like twisting it so that it's like spiraled like a barbershop thing. Um, I've seen it like this is one. I'll do this and not bend the spoon at all because, you know, my goal with this exercise is not bending the spoon. And other people are like it. I've seen them also like smash it into like multiple pieces like it just explodes in their hands without harming anyone but um so we're gonna play and the point of this is for you to sort of get to know your energy a little more so we're going to open up and bring the energy into ourselves and then we're going to send the energy through our left arm into our hand and our fingers and from the fingers into the spoon and through the spoon into the fingers and then back and we're going to uh, send it around and around but we're going to change the kind of energy that's going around so you can feel as it's more like electric energy and then we'll do love we're going to end with love energy that will be the final one but we're going to try different energies and um and we can send it from the finger through the spoon to this hand and then back and forth. We're just going to play a little bit, feeling the different energetic pulses. If at any point during the exercise you feel like you want to bend the spoon at that point, go ahead. And then if you put it down and pick up another spoon, you know, you can feel like the way it, it's sort of getting to know how different energies feel when they're flowing through. Okay. All right. So um, hold your spoon in your hands. Um, and again, it doesn't matter how you hold it, but for this one, most people feel comfortable holding through and through. Some people like might extend their fingers. Or, so try different hand positions throughout because we're playing. So there's no strict rules or regulations beyond have fun. Uh, <laughs> As soon as I said have fun, my whole spoon went, oh, <laughs> um, So again, like give your feet permission to relax. And it doesn't matter if your eyes are open and spaced out or closed. Um, give your feet permission to relax so the energy can just continue flowing through your body, through your feet, deep into earth. As your feet are relaxing, you'll notice the top of your head automatically and naturally opens up, relaxes, and receives energy to flow through your body, through your feet, deep into earth. If you feel any pain or pressure or discomfort in your head, acknowledge it and give it permission to resolve on its own. And you'll feel it will and the top of your head starts to feel light and airy as the energy, the divine cosmic energy flows into your body through you deep into earth. As this energy is flowing into your body, filtering through your mind, flowing down through your throat, into your shoulders and your heart center, invite some of this energy to flow in through your left arm, to your left shoulder, your left arm, down the bicep, and the elbow, the forearm, and the wrist into your left hand, through your fingers, into the spoon, through the spoon to your fingers of your right hand, to your knuckles, the palm of your right hand, and back of your right hand, and your wrist on up through your forearm, to your elbow, your biceps, your right shoulder, on through the clavicle to your heart center and back 
take a moment inviting this energy to flow through your arms and all the beautiful divine cosmic energy that's flowing through your body continues flowing with it as well as through your body. Feel this energy flowing through your arms, from your left hand through the spoon to your right hand. Circular around and around. Keeping the energy of your hands wide open, sending, receiving. Filling the spoon so the spoon becomes a charged receptor with all the energy particles that are flowing through you. You may even feel like the spoon is becoming like charged, energetic. It may even seem like it's growing bigger as its energy is expanding. It may feel like it's growing softer as it's becoming superheated and charged with energy. Invite this energy to flow through your arms, through this cycle, through your arms and hands and spoon faster, fuller, Invite the energy to become even brighter and sharper, electric. Imagine electricity flowing through your left arm into the spoon. Metal is a great conductor of electricity. Imagine Let the electricity flow through your spoon into your right hand, through your arms, filling your spoon with electric charge and current. And now invite keeping this energy flowing. Invite your guides and the universe to send all of their love into you. Pure love from those who love you the most most, your guides and guardians. Invite them to send all of their love into you and straight through your crown, through your mind, through your throat, down to your heart. And let your heart center just fill with this love and flow into your heart and into your left arm. And all of this electric currency becomes filled with love and love flows into your spoon fills your spoon with charged particles of electricity and love and this love then flows back to your right arm and through your heart center again and again and again flowing with electric love each time this love flows in through your heart and it merges with all the divine love 
and the love of your specific guides and guardians who just adore you and fills your heart, connects with this electric love, and expands more and more, flowing through your arm and down into the spoon, through your arm and back again. As this love is flowing down into your left hand and it flows through the spoon, mixing with all the molecules, the cells, filling them with love, electric love into your right hand. If you'd like, you can send it back from your right hand through the spoon to your left hand and then back and forth. Just each time the energy is going like waves particle waves of electric love through your spoon, back and forth, back and forth. It's an electric love seismic earthquake of the spoon. Let the energy flow through your spoon and see what happens. All of the love is flowing in through your left side. And allow all the love to flow in through your right side so that it's hitting both hands at once, going into the spoon. All at once, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. and forth. do another minute and then return to this time and space. <laughs> 